for the cheapest, fastest, most reliable muck coins on the market, check out my coin sponsors at AOEAH.com and use discount code MONEY for 3% off. Link in the description below. Welcome back, Money Team. This is Mad Money Shot. Sniff out the man. She's as always got some run plays for you guys today. A very glitchy run play scheme out of my New Orleans Saints offensive ebook. I put out some pass plays from this formation about a week or so ago. If you guys didn't catch that, I'll drop a link in the description so you guys can check out this formation's pass plays because they're as glitchy as the run plays. And it's all because of the way this formation sets up. The formation itself is the iform z close if you guys want to see a full passing and running breakdown of this offense hit the like button let me know in the comment section i'll put that out at a later date you can see right here the halfback stretch that's the first run play average almost 11 yards a carry on that particular play we'll go and put these plays in our audibles now my normal four play setup would be the pa sale the pa cross because those are the two uh, glitchy pass plays i showed in the first video uh, but the halfback stretch and the 26 duo would be my run plays. Those are the two best run plays I'm going to focus on today. Uh, but since we're not doing pass plays, we're going to go over and replace this particular one here with the ISO. And we're going to go ahead and we're going to put our pass play in the formation, which is the wide receiver curls. This is a good play as well. Now, as always, this video is brought to you by my coin sponsors at AOEH.com. If you guys want to get your team up and support the channel at the same time, all you have to do is check them out. Link in the description below and use discount code MONEY to get 3% off what's guaranteed to always be the cheapest coins on the market. So this play here, I really find like the success can be had mostly because this receiver's in so tight to the line. I really think that's a huge reason why this play blocks so well because he really can just get to that cornerback and really cut off that lane a lot quicker than a lot of other formations that don't have that tight formation. Now, the only real adjustment I would ever make on a play like this is flipping it. I don't really make any motions. I don't really do anything else. Whether it's the stretch play or the duo play, uh, I find the duo play's best flip. Like right here, it looks like we probably have a cover four. I'm going to go the opposite way. I find the duo play is a lot like a power a power O run, where I just like to flip it and run the opposite way. You can see once again, we get an easy 10 yards before anybody's even close. There's really only, uh, you know, two ways I run this. I'm going to run the stretch this way, and now it looks like we have a double safety blitz, which is going to be perfect. You can see how that tight wide receiver uh, alignment really helps me get to the edge that's really what makes this stretch play successful is that tight wide receiver alignment you could flip the stretch and run it uh the same way but i don't feel like you get the blocking that you get from the duo play if you watch the duo play look how he just gets right on that outside linebacker so let's go let's do that again like i said this is your one-two punch you really have um you know the stretch run although i feel like honestly because that cornerback's playing back the stretch run here makes the most sense like i said for whatever reason that the blocking just sets up perfectly i mean stretch plays are already good uh that's just typical it's been that way forever but this this particular one because of that tight look i don't know why it just does a really good job of maintaining that edge and especially getting to that cornerback and we have one of the best cornerbacks in the game out here in jalen ramsey former safety and he's just getting blown off the ball so you know that's pretty much your main read your main read is uh anything uh really this play is going to have success with uh, when it comes to i mean i'm getting 10 a, 10 a clip every time which is the exact same average that i have on the play as you can see it just you just get 10 yards down the field before anybody even gets close here i had to run inside a little bit a defensive uh and outside linebacker did get a little bit outside there but you can see it's still a successful run still got five yards now this looks like a perfect setup we got a cover three which means that cornerback's going to drop back once the play starts the safety is on the in the box on the other side so this is going to be perfect this will probably be my biggest run unless that defensive end blows it up and gets outside that's the only thing it's your really your only read is this defensive end there's really two ways you have to run it and this is the one read you have to make you're watching this tight end if he gets outside of his defensive ends and seals it you run outside like a stretch play if he gets beat outside like he does here you just have to take it up inside this guy here this defensive end or outside linebacker typically takes himself out of the play and you can see we still have a really good setup here i messed up the rest of this play i should have slowed down i should have waited i mean i was i was worried about that defensive end but i should have slowed down waited for this fullback to get on that linebacker if he would have sealed that i would have had another big run to the outside you can see there's nothing out here but i over i just over pursued my uh my blocker uh but you can see it's going to be a successful run regardless you can run like a stretch or you can run like a power run so we're going to do it again like so we got that same look cover three guy down the box here we get that outside block so i can just basically take it wide you can see that uh, ramsey doesn't have the speed and i'm just getting successful runs all game as long as i just watch that tight end so we hit the stretch enough let's go let's hit the duo one time like i said this is also a good successful run play as you can see it's just more of an inside run but you can really have a lot of success with both of these runs in the same direction it's a really good blocking formation and then last but not least like i said we'll show a good passing play specifically geared towards man the first uh, couple of plays we showed really worked against man or zone but this is a really good man beater the wide receiver curl we're going to pick that on the defensive side like i said this is specifically a man coverage play so we'll go we'll go with 
um, play type man coverage, then we'll hit random man. So this B route here can really beat any uh, man coverage outside. As you can see we got a, you know, the best cornerback game, 99 overall, Jalen Ramsey. It's really best to run it from a hash mark though. You're gonna give yourself much more opportunity for a catch and run. But you can see, even to the short side of the field, it did have success. So let's go, let's do that again. Like I said, Jalen Ramsey, best cornerback in the game. He's not gonna stop this, this route. You can run this all game against any man coverage. I don't even know what the man coverages are I'm looking at. And you can see, all you really have to do, typically you wanna wait till he gets outside the cornerback, but he's given up position pretty much every single time. He's just playing too far back. So it really doesn't matter. But if he is in tight, as you can see right here, you know, there he actually tried to make that play and it still didn't matter like i said it's a very glitchy play against against man coverage go do that one more time because i typically like i said i typically want to wait until he gets outside but it doesn't matter he's just giving up that space as this is just an epic easy man beater you can run all game so i'm gonna end the video there if you guys want to see the corresponding pass plays they should be popping up on the screen right now so just click that uh, and that'll take you right to the pass plays that i put out from this uh, particular offense other than that if you guys want to see a full breakdown of this offense in a future video hit the like button and let me know in the comment section other than that thanks for watching man my shit out need more help or just want to show your support then head over to my patreon and join my team where you can get exclusive content like ebooks and bonus plays as well as early access to my vids and more link in the description below Thank you.